Good morning guys. So if you haven't heard us already, I have made it to Bali, Indonesia. Yes, that is right. I landed in Denpasar International Airport last night, late at night. Um, and I found out I arrived at the right time because the active volcano around here, Mount Agoon, that actually erupted like at 7.22 p.m. last night and I landed at 9 p.m. last night. So yeah, they said they canceled a bunch of flights because of that. Um, but yeah, oh geez, I made it. <laughs> That's the main thing. But this is my accommodation. I thought I'd give you a tour because it is so, so nice. I This is actually like the first proper time I have gotten a nice accommodation for myself. Like I have been to so, so many hostels, but this is like the first time I've actually glamped and done this type of thing, but it was very, very cheap. I forgot the price of it, but I'll put the price right here. So I'm here for two weeks um, and yeah, I'll show you around guys. So first off, we have my big ginormous bed. This is so awesome, way better than hostel beds. <laughs> And I had such a great sleep last night. And I have working aircon, yes. So that was a main thing to have. I got a little refrigerator. Um, yeah, it even comes with free beer and coffee. Too bad I don't like beer and coffee, but not just nice to put it in there anyways. <laughs> and another awesome thing about this place. So this is called Pondock Murta House. Um, but oh, the thing I was excited about the most, they have free breakfast every day they give to you. <laughs> so I have like a choice of one of these out of the slot. Um, so today I think I'm going to go the scrambled egg and tomato with toast with a bit of fruit salad. Yes. You do not know how good it is to get breakfast made for you. That is just for a backpacker. That is great. And in here, we got my toilet and bathroom area. So, toilet with a view, of course. And the lovely shower that where I had got probably about a minute of hot water, but that nah, doesn't matter. <laughs> um, and I also have a back patio here. Whoa. The lady must have come around and dropped off some tea. <laughs> Sweet. But this is it guys. It is such a beautiful place and I cannot wait to spend the past two weeks here. Um, oh, also I'll show you, I'll show you my view. So yeah, right out my window. This is my beautiful view. Such a nice day today. Can't see any volcanic ash. So that's a good thing, I guess. And at the back here. Whoopsies. Wow, so not only this. Don't know what that is, but that's cool. So nice, so nice. And it is very, very warm. <laughs> so I do have a few things that I need to get done today, um, but I'm not gonna go into any of the details quite yet. At the moment, I am starving, so I think I'm gonna go get my nice free breakfast. Yum. Oh yeah, free brekkie has arrived, here it is. So this morning I've got a nice little fruit salad with some tea and some eggs and toast. This is lovely. <laughs> you do not know how excited I am about this. Just, just the little things of life like this. So, so good because I'd rather not cook my breakfast and buy breakfast, so this is a big deal for me. All right, let's enjoy. Well, breakfast was absolutely delicious. I could get used to that every day here. <laughs> um, so as I said before, I need to go off and get a few things done and sorted before I go into any sort of crazy adventures around here. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but I don't sound the best. I've got like a really runny nose and sore throat, so I'm gonna hit up the pharmacy, try to see if I can fix myself and then just get rid of all this. I'm just, uh, just going out of control. <laughs> so I'm gonna get a haircut, I'm ashamed. Uh, I noticed they have the European adapters here as well, so I don't have a European one, gotta get that. Gotta get a SIM card. 
then, yeah, I think that's good. Then I'll be good to go. So, we'll get that person. I'll see you then. Bye. Oh, yeah. Feeling fresh. Looking fine. Yeah. Whoops. Looks like I missed a spot, though. <laughs> I'll get rid of that. Ah, much better. <laughs> look at me. I look so much younger now. All right. So, I've got all my things sorted. Well, not everything. But I got my... Adapter, so as I said before, this is the European one. It's like the one with the two little circles on the end And a nice big five litre bottle of water So I think the taps aren't to be trusted around here like the tap water So it's best to just go to the local stores buy a big bottle of water and then just keep topping up your other little bottles um, So I'll just put them in my fridge So to play it safe because when I was in the Philippines, it was kind of like that too um, the tap water was a bit untrustworthy and I did get very very sick so I don't want to make that mistake again and speaking of it get sick I've got some pills to hopefully make me better <laughs> uh, I couldn't quite find a sim card yet well I did find a sim card but so the one I want to find I heard it's the best one it's called Telkin, Telkin Sim Telkin Som. Uh, I found one along the main strip in Ubered but they were charging me 200,000. That's for like eight gigabyte for say a month. But I'm pretty sure there is way, way cheaper ones, like less than half that price. So I'm gonna try to see if I can find a main shop to get a lot cheaper and just look around. <coughs> um, yeah, so my plans guys from here on in, as I said before, I'm gonna be in Ubered for two weeks in this beautiful accommodation. Then after here, I'm going to be going down to Changu, and I've got another two weeks of amazing accommodation there. All right, then after Bali, I actually have to fly over to Kuala Lumpur because I needed a ticket out of Bali. God damn, Japan made me do that. <laughs> uh, but that doesn't matter. I've changed my plans around, and I'll just see more of Indonesia after that. So I've got another 30 months visa free. Um, and yeah, guys, so I don't know quite what I'm gonna do with the videos, but I'm gonna to try to hopefully keep posting up at least two videos a week. Um, by the time I post this video up, it is probably gonna be through, halfway through my trip in Bali, because <laughs> I've still got plenty more amazing um, Japan content to post up. And if you're watching this video right now, be sure to watch that Japan content, because it is pretty cool. Um, but yeah, other than that guys, I've got a few other good plans for around Bali. I'm really, really looking forward to it. And just walking along the main strips of Ubud at the moment, uh, Bali is so much different, more different than I thought. Like, I kept thinking it was going to be really, I don't know, run down and just dirty because of how many tourists there are, but they've ma managed to maintain the streets really, really clean. Um, and they definitely encounter it <coughs> for tourists because Every single shop and place you go to along the main strip in Ubud is just restaurants, cafes, villas, nice places to stay at. Uh, so yeah, there's there's a lot of lot of things to do for tourists here, um, and it's cheap, but not local cheap. <coughs> if you do go outside of the main touristy spots, it will be probably way way more cheaper. Just to let you know. Um, but yeah, no, by the looks of it, I'm really enjoying Bali so far. Bali, if you don't know, is like an Aussie haven <laughs> because it is one of like the nicest, closest places to get to from Australia and return flights to Bali from Australia is dirt, dirt cheap. So you, your majority of the times we'll see a lot of Australians here. It's like the Aussie island. <laughs> um, but. I really, really cannot wait to just begin all my adventures around Bali. I've got a few things planned, but I'll figure it out along the way. Um, but yeah, guys, get excited because I am very, very keen to be here. There's gonna be some amazing videos to come. Um, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Follow your dreams, escape your cover zone, and be sure to see my Bali adventures. Bye. Well, hold up. I forgot to mention one more thing, and that is, please subscribe, guys. <laughs> okay, so I've got so many more great videos to come, and I don't want you guys to miss out on my epic Bali adventures. So please join along on my adventures as well. 
follow your dreams, escape your comfort zone, hit that subscribe button and the little ding-a-ling bell so you get all the notifications and come join me in Bali Paradox. Thanks, bye, see you then.